Hello, welcome to the new success stuff video. We're going to be testing uh, this URGI uh, 11.5 inch, um, uh, becoming a really, really popular uh, gun. Uh, these are at the moment, so uh, trending quite well. Uh, so this particular one has had the Magpul um, CTR stock conversion on the back here, so to FDE. Uh, and uh, obviously we've installed the um, battery here in the end of the butt pad uh, and we're going to be providing two batteries uh, with the build. Um, so we've also got uh, installed a Gate Titan uh, basic uh, MOSFET system inside there to obviously give the increased trigger response and full cycle completion. We've got the uh, Warhead um, uh, high speed motor in there. We've got the um, Prometheus uh, double torque gears we've got, uh, which obviously are incredibly hard uh, and uh, uh, obviously last a very, very long time. Uh, we've got the uh, six millimeter bearings, the Prometheus type ball barrel, um, Prometheus selector plate, spring guide, air nozzle, cylinder, cylinder head, tappet plate. Uh, we've got the uh, Eagle Six uh, joining bar, which is uh, on the top here. And um, it's uh, got, uh, uh, sorry, just uh, to obviously uh, the original one can sometimes break, so obviously we'll replace it because of that. Uh, we've got the uh, Lalax trigger pin on the side. We've got the um, uh, Eagle Six uh, harder recoil spring, um, and we've got the uh, Eagle Six M90. And uh, obviously we've done. Um, Uh, we've got the Prometheus purple set on this one, a uh, hot rubber set. And let me just double check that. No, nope, no, nope, this is our hop on this one. So uh, we've got our hop on that. Uh, and uh, AOE spacer, and I've done uh, 65 meter range testing um, on uh, 0.32s, uh, which is passed. And uh, we're chronoing at 300 FPS on uh, three twos. Uh, so, uh, and we sent you a picture uh, to show that. So, uh, so yeah, uh, all in all, uh, fully tested uh, and ready to go. We're just gonna demonstrate it working now uh, as a proof of life. Can't follow the man. See the rate of fire is pretty damn good on this one. Uh, so it's 16, so it's on the limit there for um, uh, the um, NGRS recoil builds. And uh, but we've been leaning towards the um, high speed motor and the double torque gears is a better combo. Um, we just think it's obviously it's a lovely, lovely rate of fire to have it going at that, if you know what I mean. So obviously we tend to lean towards the slower uh, uh, speed motor um, because it's obviously much safer, um, but um, you know, how enjoyable is that rate of fire? So um, uh, we, uh, we're pretty, you know, uh, uh, comfortable with obviously 16, but um, don't put like an 11 volt on there or anything like that because I mean, you'll just cut it in a, in a couple of seconds. So, but, uh, uh, but we're pretty comfortable with this uh, config going forward as our, our new, um, new setup. So if you're ever at all worried about rate of fires, uh, the uh, gate titans, you can um, digitally lower the rate of fire on there. Uh, and obviously it's always going to be fast, it's a peak battery, so um, which is obviously when it's uh, freshly, freshly charged like this one is.
got a long way this one, so I want to make sure that uh, it's demonstrated uh, working. all working and good uh, I hope the spilled specification which we're going to put in the description for the video uh, is adequate for you and uh, uh, exactly what you've asked for and um, we'll hopefully be able to get this uh, sent over to you obviously it's got to go a long way uh, but uh, we'll go through all the hoops we need to to get that to you okay cool brilliant thank you